All right, team. Vegan chocolate Shakeology. Just got two samples. Had to pay for them. Uh, one is naked. It's just Shakeology and water and ice. And the other one is with a banana and peanut butter. Carl Deco special. Um, I did read the information on it a little bit. It is slightly more calories than the other two. 170 calories. Slightly more fat. 3 grams of fat, which is still pretty low. And that's mostly from the raw cacao beans that they used uh, for this. So, here we go. Let's give them a taste. There you go. There's the raw one. They made it a little chunkier than I like. But... Can tell a little bit different in taste uh, than the way. Doesn't feel gritty to me though, like a lot of brown rice proteins are. Uh, let's taste the Carl Deckler special. Now for me that tastes absolutely no different than the way. It doesn't taste any different at all. Um, so I think if you're going to have it plain, <clears throat> you'll taste a little bit of difference. But if you usually put a banana in or some peanut butter in or some fruit in, I don't think you're going to taste any difference. And you get the benefit of the um, sprouted brown rice protein, which is more bioavailable than whey. They've already started... They've, They've also started putting moringa in these, which is a phenomenal super food. Um, has something crazy like seven times the amount of calcium as milk does. A whole bunch of other super food properties. I'm not sure we'll hear more about it. And it's actually going to permeate throughout the throughout the line. Moringa will start going in throughout the line. So there you go. Vegan, uh, vegan chocolate, Shakeology. That will be available on Tuesday. Let's see. 23rd, 24th, 25th, I think it is. June 25th, and then packets later in the week, so uh, as well as challenge packs will start having it uh, in about a week. So there you go. There's the two Shakeologies. I think you should definitely give it a try. I'll give it another review once I get a full bag and start really tasting it rather than just a sip. But the, the raw one does taste a little bit a little bit different, but uh, not bad, just a little bit different, which you'd expect. Whey does smooth things out a little bit, as opposed to uh, it's probably brown rice protein. So that's it from Summit right now. Talk soon, guys. Bye.